Hi everyone, it's Ruby and Rayleigh and welcome back to our channel. Today in this video we are joined with our cousin. Hello. And in this video we're going to be doing a three colour marker art swap challenge. Back to school edition. <laughs> We've done this challenge before and we did it as a 10 minute art swap canvas challenge. And it's coming to that time of year where everyone's thinking about stationery and back to school things so we thought we'd do this with pencil cases. Mm -hmm. So we've got our cousin Oliver with us here today. Some of you may know him from a video we filmed a couple years ago. So we thought it would be good to include him in a challenge and do a three colour marker video with him. Sounds good. If you didn't watch the last version of this challenge then how it's going to work is we're each going to be given a pencil case and three separate colours of marker. We will then be given five minutes which will be set on a timer for us to create something with the markers and the pencil cases in five minutes and then we're going to swap and repeat. There will also be two separate stages to this challenge. Stage one is the initial challenge where you have the three markers and you create design and stage two will be where we are given some markers to finish it off like outlines yeah. and things. Here are the four options. Option number one, show this one. This one's white and it's got two zippers on. Really Option like number two is your typical kind of oval rectangle pencil case with one zip. Yeah. Option number three, a cream pencil case, very flat, very canvas. Cute. Option number four, a plain white version of that one except it's bigger. Your turn to go first, don't pick one I want. Which one do you want? Don't know. Don't tell me. Just don't get it wrong. <laughs> I'll get this one then. Okay, cool. I didn't want that one. Good. Uh, I'm going to pick this one because it's definitely a nice little pencil case. Fun fact, you just lost the two ones I was thinking I, I thought you would want them. I want this one. You picked up both of them, I'm going to go a bit. Oh no, I want this one. <laughs> okay. So this is my pencil case, but it doesn't really matter because it's kind of being all the art. Yeah, we're mm -hmm. passing this around. We're yeah. starting here. Your turn. This is mine, right? And I like it because it has a gold zipper. Mm -hmm. But unfortunately, this will probably be like vandalised. By the end, yeah. <laughs> By these. Especially because Oscar started with it. <laughs> <laughs> We're calling them different names by O for no reason, but to confuse you all. And this one is mine, this one is plain, it's got a black zip and I like it. And what we're going to do now is we're going to pick three separate colours each for our pencil cases. And this is important because when we pass the pencil cases around, we're also going to pass those colours. So the pencil case will be three colours. You ready? Go. Rock, paper, scissors. No! You would have assumed I was going to pick scissors then. So I thought you were going to pick rock, but then my brain didn't function enough to actually remember that. What I was supposed oh, to pick after that. What a shame. Anyway, I'm going first. You know what she's going to pick. Why are you drinking every five seconds? Pick Come on, Oscar. You can do better than this. <laughs> right, Owen. Are we ready? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm going to go with the purple. I got an oh, idea nice. in mind. I didn't expect that. Whose turn's next? Ruby or Owen? Oliver. I'm going to go for it. I'm gonna, I want that one. I knew he was going to have that. Mm. Wait, I gotta think about this. What will you want? You will want. Are you gonna pick the one I want? Yeah. No. Oh, we're gonna I get it wrong. Shh. Uh. Mm. Pink. You just didn't pick the one I wanted. I know. I, I want a bright colour though before okay. they're all gone. For me, it was between yellow tones, and I don't like the colour yellow, so I needed to like compromise. So I thought of gold or peach, and I'm going with peach. Very nice. It's blue. My colour blindness is like. What colour does it look? It looks like. I can't tell if it's purple. You can't I, see I never, purple. I never trust if it's purple so or not. They look the same. Yeah, they look exactly the same. Blue and green. Okay. Yay! Yeah. Go. I wonder the colours I wanted. Oh. Okay. Uh, What's this change? Yeah. I'm gonna go for a grey. That's all. <laughs> I want gold. Mm. Oh, do I go yellow? Or orange. I go orange. Oh, and you get yellow. <laughs> there you go. I nearly went for the yellow as well, but I thought. I nah, thought they look of, good together. I've got kind of like pastel-y colours. So not quite pastel, but they're pastel enough for me. We've got everything ready now. We've got our pencil cases, our three colours, our timer, and our time lord ready. Oh no. <laughs> I hate that name. Anyway. I love it. We have one rule to this challenge, which is you cannot go over something that somebody's already drawn. Aww. Aww. Unless at the end we're doing highlighting where you have to highlight it. And also we've put pieces of paper in our pencil cases so it doesn't bleed through on the other yeah. side. That's the top tip. You ready? No. 
But yeah. Right, press the timer, Odin. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh, okay. One minute thirty six. No, don't stress me out. Woo! Oh no, I've decided to colour something in just as I run out of time. Timer! <laughs> I, I don't even know what this is. Here's what I've done I created a flower scene. Show yours now. Go on, Odin. Dog. We've got Ruby there, just standing, <gasps> looking at looking at the, the dog, and then we've got... Don't you dare, that's not me. <laughs> <laughs> what about you? Time is going so well, until a bunch of blotches came on it. But I hope someone can like try and make that look good. Yeah. No. No. I think that's a bit of a lot it of It Spongebob Squarepants, and I don't like that. <laughs> Who lives in a pineapple under the sea? Ruby Squarepants. So, this is where they all are now, and we're going to swap them in this direction. Who's... Okay. Go on, Otto. There you go. Thank I you. I need the pens, please. Oh, and you get these pens? Yeah. Thank you. Awesome. Oh. I feel like when it gets built up, it's going to look more graffiti. Yeah, you like it will look nicer. Yeah. Right, you ready, Otis? Yeah, let's go. Set the timer. Oh, we need to do the timer, don't we? Right, go. No one not. I don't know what to do. I'm on the other side. Oh. No. And we're out of time. I would just like to do a quick disclaimer. I messed up on this one. Oliver, you have my explicit permission to fix that. I tried to do something pop party, half worked. It went wrong at the point where the this silver pen exploded all over it. So the letters kind of lost the fact that they're letters. Yeah, the grey one keeps exploding everywhere. Yeah. It so do for me. Do it on that. You can instead. fix that if you want. I'll, I'll, I'll try. I feel that's be that'll be better to do in the highlighting stage if we've got some thin ones, like mm. some thin white and black ones. Yeah. I tried. Says meow. Yeah, I wrote meow for no reason whatsoever, so I didn't get to finish filling it in. So Ruby can finish filling that in. And with this one, I added on some little swirly things around the dog thing, which I really mm. like. And the back I actually really like this. It says Oliver. Because nice. I forgot that it was actually Jen. I'm guessing this is naturally Oliver's. But now we can switch. Uh, we'll. we'll Cover it over in the highlighting stage, it's fine. I get, I get the one really started with. Okay. No covering, just expanding. Right. I'm ready, I know what I'm doing. Let's reset this timer. Three, two, one, go. I feel like we're about to run out of time. Yeah, we definitely are. I forgot the timer was even on. Honestly, so did I. No! Oh, yes, cool right that. as I finish. I actually love what I did. Right, so what I Ooh, did, I did a few things. I started out by doing like a eye thing. I was limited to colour, so it does look a bit funny. And then I did a little plant. And then I turned it around, did a bit of a planet. And then a few swirls to kind of even it out a bit. Swirlies. So yeah. I added some little shapes onto Rayleigh's like, I like wow. That. And then I wrote like, a little message saying, I love dogs, lol. <laughs> because everyone knows lol, right? And then on the back, I drew some more blotches. That's, and I wrote, that's not the back. The front. <laughs> and on the front, where Ruby did these disgusting little <laughs> blotches, I wrote blotch to make it look intentional. <laughs> I really like the shapes that you did. I really like that. The, the shapes are good. Yeah. Goodbye. With this one, I added quite a few little things to it. I added some mushroom and I added a sun, which I actually really love. And on the back, I said buzz. Ooh. Thanks. Because the bee. Biz, biz. Very nice. And now we're going to swap them all again. I, I got, got Oliver's again. Three, two, one. Finished it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so for this one, I saw a massive space on the back and decided to use it to my advantage. If either of you go in this space, I'm going to be massively mad because you two will add something weird to it. <laughs> so I did an eye. I finished this in about three minutes actually because I've drawn this style so many times I'm used to doing it quickly. 
And I'm very happy with how I did that. I'm quite proud of that one, actually. I don't know what I did. I can't <laughs> actually remember. Oh yeah, um, I ran out of ideas. So I coloured this heart, uh, this side of it green. And I wrote yay on it. <laughs> and the eye. I did draw the eye. On the zip line, you did zip. And with mine, I basically, I had loads of swivel things on it. And then I added like speech bubbles around all the words. And I feel like it's made it really, really pop arty. It's very pop arty, which I really like. And I was going to say Van Gogh. <laughs> but I really love it. So I'm happy with what I've done. Please don't ruin my part, Ray. I won't. Can you pass me? There, you can ruin that all you want. I actually really like some of it. I think we need a few more and then we're done. Okay, right. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, go. <laughs> Let's go, okay. Just as I finished. I, I, oh, thank God you never you know. got onto that side. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah. So, with this one, I have done quite a lot of little things. I added more swirly things around the dog. I added a little thing on the top saying subscribe to Rage UK because self promo, it's time. Down. I'm almost not, <laughs> I'm almost on 100k, so make sure to go subscribe to my channel, please. <laughs> I want that plaque. As you can tell, the meow is now complete. So, I saw some flowers. So I thought, hmm, what do flowers do? They do photosynthesis, right? Oh. So I wrote photosynthesis with an F <laughs> and an F. Photosynthesis, right? Photosynthesis. And then I drew a big arrow pointed to the flowers. So obviously I finished off the meow. What are mushrooms? Mushrooms are fungi or fungi. I oh no! <laughs> right? Oh, I didn't realise that. So I pointed to the mushrooms. Dad joke. <laughs> And, and put what a fun guy <laughs> in hopes that someone will draw eyes on them during the uh, during the highlight stage. <laughs> what I did is decided to fill up the space on the front that hadn't been filled yet. So where um, Otis wrote blotch, I <laughs> went over it in a grey and demonstrated like a blotch or something. And then I went around it without going over the stuff that was already there. I avoided them and kind of did some squiggles to frame it a bit. I think it looks quite cool, I also shaded it. So, we've got two more rounds before we get our original pencil case back. And between that time, we're not gonna show on the front camera because it'll make more of a final reveal towards the end. And these are usually the rounds where they change the most. Yeah, they are. Yeah, on that note. Oh, ah. Ah! What's wrong with me? That was efficient. Okay, so we'll see you when we've had two more rounds of this. Three, two, one, and... Ooh. Time. Last round before detail. Let's go. Okay. Our time. Are you happy with what everyone's looks like? I love mine. So this is the final round where we're going to finish them off and do details and any highlights. We have three little detail pens. We have a silver one, a black one and a, and a white one and they're all like smaller versions so they're more for detailing. Once we've got our pen we're going to finish them all off and we're not going to take five minutes because we want them to be as good as they can be. And we're not going to swap them, we're just going to keep them now and finish them off. Rock, paper, scissors. I want the black one. No! Rock, paper, scissors. I win. <laughs> oh no. Cool. I'm gonna finish my pencil case off with a black. I'm gonna finish it off with a silver. And I'm gonna finish my pencil case off with a white. On that note, let's go and we'll see you for the final reveal. This is really changing the design and I really love it. I'm excited about it now. Mine's bringing some stuff to the table, definitely. Whoa, that looks good. Does it? Oh, that yeah. looks so good. It looks really like... Right, we finished now and I'm really, really excited about what I've created actually. So I'm gonna show you my final reveal pencil case first. I'm gonna show you one three. Two, 
one. So this is mine from the front. I chose this in the front because it's my favorite yeah. side of it. It's really cool and the highlights and the tones definitely get more kind of bam or pow. <laughs> I really like it. And then the back. I don't really know what the back is, but I've de cool. it's definitely improved more and it definitely is really cool. Yeah. But altogether, I really like them. My favourite part would definitely be the words because they look really nice and they're very yeah, um, nice pop arty. You know, I wasn't fully convinced that these were going to look good for a lot of this challenge. Me neither. But looking at them now, they are very cool and they look like they look like graffiti walls. Like they really do look like graffiti walls. I think it's really cool. So this is my final three colour pencil case. I really like it and I love all the colours together and it's definitely really pop arty. This is the other side. This was supposed to be the front but I actually prefer the other side more so. So this pencil case uh, is very wild. Here's the reveal. Uh, there seems to be 20 different things happening at once. So this is the front and this is the back. If you look on the outside of the pencil case, you see it's all gone silver. Silver is a very cool color. Right, now I'm gonna show mine and I'm really happy that I got black on mine because it really changed it and fixed it, I think. So here it is, there's the front, and like the other two, it looks like a graffiti wall. Um, it says meow on it, thanks for that one. But I think that's like a really cool part of the image. And you can see the flowers I originally did, some of Oscar's writing. <laughs> Oscar. His name is Oliver, by the way. Oliver, um, <laughs> whatever you wanna call him, he's fine with it. And some of Ruby's mushrooms, which I like. And then obviously we have the eye that I drew on the back, paired with where Ruby wrote Buzz. This is the front. And this is the back. And this is the collection together. So that is the end of our video. We really hope you enjoyed. Just to recap, this is all of the stuff we made. This is the front and this is the back. We have two shout outs for this week's video. The first shout out goes to Mel, who tagged us on a really nice painting on Instagram. Here it is. They also have an Instagram account, which is here as well. Make sure to go check it out. Second shout out goes to G, who tagged us in a very beautiful drawing of an eye. G also has an Instagram account, which displays more portraiture art, which is definitely worth a follow. Our Instagram is Ruby and Rayleigh, and I also have a new TikTok account, which I finally made when I was 13. It's called Official Ruby Rose King. Make sure to go check it out, because I post a lot on that. That is the end of our video, really, this time. <laughs> we want to thank all of our for being on our channel. Thank you for having me. It is nice You're to hear my actual name in this video for the first time. You're welcome, Otis. We love you. Bye. Bye. Hey, everyone. It's Ruby and Rayleigh. <laughs> welcome to the channel. Today, we are doing something, <laughs> and I don't know what we're doing. Today, in this video, we are joined with a special guest, our cousin. Hey, up. <laughs> so we've got our cousin. 